guys, so I am so excited because the thrift store is open again, finally for spring. Um, it's been so cold here and even still snowing and icy and I mean most of it's melted by now, but it's been such cold bad weather that I was worried they wouldn't open for spring because it wasn't really springy, but they did. I want to show you what I got first from the thrift store and then I went to Just a Buck. Our Just a Buck has a new manager and they have so much nice stuff in there now, like better than they had. It's like really stepped up. So I'm gonna start with the thrift store. I got some long sleeve stuff. Um, focusing more on like summery stuff because we're getting there. But this was one, actually there's another one too. Long sleeve things for Cassidy. Like usual, I found the most for her because she's the youngest. You guys know if you go to thrift stores and you have kids, like the older they get, I guess they wear out their clothes more or I don't know, but there's like less choices the older the children get. The baby section is huge and then it's like, gets less and less. But anyway, this is for Cassie. It's from the children's place and it's got these hearts and wings and stuff. It says peace and love. It's a little bit glittery. Roses. Um, these aren't going to be in any order. We're going to go from summer to winter, but... I got her this Jumping Beans brand skirt. I love these skirts because they have the shorts underneath so she can wear them playing and running and doing whatever in the summertime. I also got these shorts. I thought were cute. They're PS from Aeropostel. And then these ones, which I really like because they're more like Bermuda shorts. Um, she has some like these too, but these are Circo brand, but they're longer. Not like super short shorts. I also got her this dress. This is children's place. This is so pretty. It's got this like detail on the top. Kind of like scrunchy and stretchy. And then it goes down. It's got two tiers like that. This I got because um, for next year, the year after, I said it's not my videos. I buy all my, not all, but 99% of like the kids holiday like t-shirts and stuff like that I buy secondhand because like the kids wear them once for the holiday and that's it so they don't get worn out much and also I don't want to pay for a shirt that they're gonna wear like a handful of times so this will be probably for Cassie to grow into um, you know for St. Patrick's Day in the future and this is made in Guatemala it doesn't say oh wait it says Target this little itty tag says Target on it. I don't know if you can see that. I got one pair of shorts for Haley. These are from Children's Place. They're this army green and they're soft and stretchy and the longer like Bermuda hearts, Bermuda, Bermuda hearts, Bermuda shorts, they have a little heart detail on the side. That's what I'm trying to say. But they're comfy. She likes like stretchy pants instead of jeans. Then, in this bag, <laughs> this shirt for Cassie, it's chilled, no, it's Carter's, and it says, Mommy Sweetheart, I like the colors in it, in the white, and then these two t-shirts for summer, this is Okie Dokie brand, and it says, love, 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 and it's got these cute little ties, and it's glittery and tie-dye, and then this shirt is just Faded Glory from Walmart, that is pretty color, and it's just plain. This, the one thing I found for Oliver, um, it's a jacket, but it says our school name because this thrift store is in our, I don't think it's in our school district, but it's close. The other one I go to has all, is in another school district, so everything there says that school. But I've had luck finding stuff, like hats and shirts and stuff with our school logo on them. So anyway, this is what the jacket looks like. You probably can't really see it. It's just a black jacket, but it's like, I don't know, sporty, what do you call this? Vinyl? I don't know, what is this? Polyester. And then here it says the school and soccer. And he plays soccer and he goes to that school. So that, and the very last thing I found was this jacket. I've been looking for like a trench coat type jacket for a long time because when it's cold out and I go somewhere fancy, I'm still wearing my, um, Columbia jacket, which is nice, but it's like bright aqua. I'm looking at it over here. 
and it doesn't really go. I had to unfortunately go to a funeral the other day and it was really cold out and I had on nice black like dress clothes underneath and I had this bright crazy blue jacket. So I've been wanting just like a nice looking jacket to wear either to church or wherever. And this is Stonebrook? Stanbrook? I don't know. That, but it's just a nice like trench coat. I didn't even know it was like lined on the inside so it's warm too. But it's just tan, it's got the belt. I don't know if you guys can see it that well, but it'll just be nice and dressy, over dressier clothes, if that makes sense. So then I went to the dollar store, Just a Buck. Can I see that, that you just opened? Can I see the label? No, the, okay. Our cat Mimi's birthday is today. So I got her this, which Haley opened because she's making her a cake right now. But this is Kathy Ireland Loved Ones Catnip. Um, but it came in this, the catnip was in here, but it is this really pretty tin that that was in. Okay, the other step was um, I got some of these flower starter things because I actually got a bunch of seeds and you have to start them in the house, I think like a couple weeks ago, probably, already behind the game, but I got these and there's four of these in here. So, it's a lot of room. I got dish soap, I usually get Dawn, but this was in there and I'd rather have Ajax than run out and have nothing. So we got that. We've got, um, Cassidy really wanted me to get acrylic paint and I've gotten it there before, but today I couldn't find any. So I got these watercolor paints that I don't think are gonna be any good. Cause, well, I don't know. They're move around in the thing, but they just look like that. I don't know if these are gonna be any good, honestly. So I also grabbed some just poster paint. Um, Haley paints a lot and she wants to paint like Haley, but Haley's, you know, gonna be 12 and um, she's a lot neater about it, especially with the acrylic paint that stains everything. So hopefully she'll, I don't know. I might bring these back because the brown is kind of like hard and I don't think these are gonna really work out, but this one should be okay. The last things I got were, if you guys saw my Walmart haul, you know I got these Velcro sticker things for my library class for um, like felt board and stuff like that. It was like three something for one pack. So I found them in the dollar store and I grabbed three of them because I'm not gonna find them that cheap again. And the very last things were, one was this squishy for somebody, somebody I know. It's just like a little muffin, but for a dollar, it's usually the squishies are more expensive. And that's for Haley. And then they had bows. Now, you guys have little girls, you know, bows can get crazy expensive. And Cassidy has so many bows, she did not need any bows. But these were all these like summer prints and they were so cute. I had to restrain myself because she has so many, she didn't need any. But I got this mermaid looking scale one. It's so cute and so pretty and bright and summer color. And then I fell in love with this one and I actually got two so I can put pigtails in her hair and have the two flamingo Bows. You can wear this to school too, Haley, if you want to wear one. Doesn't your teacher like flamingos? No. There's a girl in Haley's, a woman that works in Haley's school that loves flamingos. But they were just so cute. What brand are these? It just says flamingo hair bow. And this one just says mermaid hair bow. Um, made in China. I don't know, but they had so many. I wish I would have taken a picture. But a ton, a ton, a ton of really cute bows. So that was everything I got today and yeah thank you guys for watching and I will see you next time in my next video bye